Demo 3.11 Review Asset Explorer In this demo, we will review the Asset Explorer. The Asset Explorer provides an overview of all the activities related to an asset, including acquisition data, planned and posted depreciation for different depreciation areas, and comparisons of data across multiple years. Use the SAP Easy Access menu to navigate to the Asset Explorer screen. Alternatively, enter the transaction code AW01N in the command field to directly access the transaction. In this demo, we will use the SAP Easy Access menu to navigate to the desired transaction. First, expand the accounting menu by clicking on the arrow next to the menu label. In the accounting menu, expand the financial accounting menu. In the Financial Accounting menu, expand the Fixed Assets menu. In the Fixed Assets menu, expand the Asset menu. In the Asset menu, select the AW01N Asset Explorer transaction. In the Initial Asset Explorer screen, we must first enter some basic data. Click on the search icon to the right of the company code field to display a list of available company codes. Select US00 Global Bike Incorporated and then click the enter icon. Next, we must select the asset. To display a list of assets, click on the search icon to the right of the asset field. Select Office Computer 000 and click the Enter icon. The basic data are now complete. To display the asset details, click the Enter icon. The Asset Explorer screen is divided into numerous sections. The header, tabs for planned values, posted values, comparisons, and parameters. The Planned Values tab has been selected and the depreciation areas are listed in the top left part of the screen. Note that the book depreciation is being displayed. The Planned Values tab displays the planned depreciation values for the selected depreciation area. The tab also displays the transactions related to the acquisition of the asset. Click on the Posted Values tab to continue. The Posted Values tab displays the acquisition value of the asset and the depreciation values that were posted in the depreciation run. Click on the Comparisons tab to continue. The Comparisons tab displays acquisition, depreciation, and book value data for multiple years. Click on the Parameters tab to continue. The Parameters tab displays current settings for the parameters used to calculate depreciation, such as the Depreciation Key, DEP Key, Useful Life, and Residual or Scrap Value. Click on the Federal Tax link to view asset data for that depreciation area. The Federal Tax Depreciation tabs show similar information to the Book Depreciation tabs, but they are designed specifically to meet Federal Tax Reporting requirements. Click on the Parameters tab. The Parameters tab for Federal Tax the parameters needed to calculate Federal Asset Depreciation. Note that the Depreciation key is different from the one used in the case of Book Depreciation. Click the Master Data icon to view the master data related to the selected asset. The system displays the Display Asset Master Data screen. The data are divided into numerous tabs. The General tab is selected. It displays general master data for the asset, such as description, quantity, and account determination. To continue, click the Time Dependent tab. The Time Dependent tab displays business area and cost center data for the asset. 
To continue, click the Debt Prec Depreciation Areas tab. The Debt Prec Areas tab displays data related to the valuation methods used to depreciate the asset. Click the back icon to return to the Asset Explorer screen. The Asset Explorer has several distinct icons for its unique capabilities. To display a list of icons and their definitions, click on the Icon Legend icon. The Icon Legend screen shows the various icons used in the Asset Explorer and lists their meaning. Demo 3.11 Review Asset Explorer